hi guys welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new today's video is a massive car clean out before we go on our road trip i get a lot of questions about how i deal with the dog hair and of course dog hair goes in the car because we take our dogs a lot of places so here's how i deal with it and here's how dirty it was before i started also at the end of this video i'll be sharing a giveaway with you guys um, that i'll be doing over on my instagram so make sure you stay tuned for that So the first thing I do is obviously go through the car and get out anything that shouldn't be in the car, like random stuff that just kind of collects in there and bring in the house and throw away. And then after that, I just take out the mats that are in our car and lay them out so that I can vacuum them. So I found that this is the best way to clean these mats. These are just like the regular carpet mats that came with the car, which collect a lot of dog hair. So I just take my regular big shark vacuum and I lay them out and just hold them down with my foot and vacuum them like regular carpet and it works really well. So after that, I'm just moving the seats and laying them down because we put the dogs in the back of the SUV, so a lot of their hair, even with the cover there, will get on the back of those seats and stuff, so I just like to clean that. But the first thing that I do is use the hose attachment in the back and just clean um, kind of like the sides of the car and get up as much as I can with it. And then after that, I just put literally put the whole vacuum in there and vacuum it like normal. This works really well because the brush roll spins and it's like it gets up all the hair. So definitely try this if you can't get it out with the hose. And then on the sides, there's like a lot of sand and stuff from the dogs being back there and taking them to the beach and their hair and stuff. So I just vacuumed it a little bit and then used one of those like car wipes and just wiped it out. CX-9. Um, it's a third row, which the seats are down because we always have them down because the dogs go in the back, um, but it's perfect for us. It'd be perfect if you had kids. Um, we really love this car. using the hose attachment and getting behind these seats a lot of their hair will like fall in there and just like crumbs and random stuff
So now I'm just laying the back seats back up. This is the second row um, and I'm just gonna vacuum and wipe them down. And then, of course, I'm using the hose attachment with like the finer attachment on it um, and doing behind the front seats on the carpet. Um, there isn't a ton because, again, I took the mats out, so everything was pretty much on the mats, but there's a little bit in like the cracks and under the seats. Now moving to the front of the car, the driver's is obviously where it gets the dirtiest because that's the most um, that people are, are in there is when you're driving. So yeah, I'm just using that. Again, most of it was on the mat, but there's definitely a lot like on the pedals and on the side of the seat and all that. take those wipes these are just some mcguire's car wipes i think i got them from like autozone or something um just wiping down the seat the steering wheel and everything else this doesn't get too dirty um but it's definitely a little bit dusty So then after I've cleaned and vacuumed the inside of it, I'm just moving the mats back in. Um, the bottom of this mat got a little bit dirty from the sawdust that was in the garage, so I just vacuumed that and then flipped it back over and put it in its place. It has Velcro, so it sticks down easily.
car cover that we have for our dogs for our car um we have the cargo one is what it's called it's from chewy and i'll link it down below but i love it and it fits the back of our car super well but i just wanted to vacuum it off and get most of the hair off of it and just kind of shake it out and then i just put it back in the car we leave this in the car all the time because we do take the dogs a lot of places and we don't have kids so there's really no reason to ever take it out As for the giveaway that I was talking about in the beginning of this video, this company was nice and they sent this to me to reveal my channel and check out for you guys. And because I already have my own cover that fits the cargo and I don't use the bench to put the dogs on, I decided that I would give it away to one of you guys. So head over to my Instagram at Emily Marie Bruce to see what the instructions are for the giveaway and to enter. I'll pick somebody a week from when I post this video. So this is from OK Me, I think that's how you pronounce it, on Amazon. It's a bench seat cover protector um, for most cars, trucks, and SUVs. It's easy to install. Um, it's like a hammock kind, non-slip and scratch proof. So here's just me putting it in the car and it was really easy to install. It has the things on the side so that um, you can put that up if you don't want the dog to like jump out or whatever. Um, but I love the detailing on it. As you guys can see, it has this like leather um, detailing and then it has the clips that go behind the headrest, which is nice. And then also it has the little like pockets thing where you can still um, put a car seat in if you wanted to. So if you do have kids, that would be nice. And then it attaches to the headrest of the front seat to make a little hammock. And then it does have a little like clear screen, which I think is really nice if you have the air conditioning in the back so that the dogs can get a little bit of airflow. Um, and also if you have kids too, and so that they can see through so they're not, if you have a small dog, it's easier for them to see. Um, and then it did come with these seatbelt clips for your dog, which I know these are kind of controversial, but it did come with them if you do want to use them and has the little pockets for you to put it into the seatbelt. So now I'm just putting Jackson Daisy in the car. I wanted to try it out with the dogs in it to see how it went and also to take a picture for the giveaway. So yeah, here's the dogs in it. They were really confused because they always go in the back of the car and not on the seat. Um, but yeah, as you can see, when I open the door, they don't jump out because that little barrier is there, which is super nice um, to kind of protect your dogs from running away or jumping out if you have that problem. But yeah, the dogs really liked it. It was super nice. It fit the car very well. Um, so yeah, I definitely recommend this. much it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed make sure you head over to my instagram to see what the giveaway instructions are and i wish you guys good luck make sure you subscribe like this video comment down below follow me on my instagram and the dogs and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys